Take a deep breath and step away from the distractions. For just a few minutes, let's have a moment together, just you and me, says the Lord. I know how overwhelming life can get sometimes. I see the weight you've been carrying, and I know how heavy it feels. But in this moment, I want to speak directly to your heart. I want you to know that I've heard every word of your prayers, every tear you've shed, every time you've whispered for help. I've been listening. I am not distant from you, and I am certainly not unaware of what you're going through. I am already at work, even if you can't see it yet. I'm moving behind the scenes, turning things around in your favor. Right now, it might feel like everything is against you. I know you've faced moments where people have hoped for your failure or where circumstances seem determined to bring you down. But don't let that consume you. Don't focus on what is tearing you down, but on what is building you up. You are stronger than you think, and this is not the end of your story. Stay strong, stay courageous. You're not alone. I've been with you through every step, even when you didn't feel it. You've seen my hand in your life before, and I haven't left you now. Close your eyes and just breathe for a moment. Can you feel my presence? I'm here, filling every empty place in your heart. I'm here with peace, a peace that the world can't offer. Walk with me. Hold on to my hand because I promise you this. I am never letting go, not for a second. I am your father. I am always loving, always faithful, and I am always watching over you. I hear the cries of those who trust in me, who aren't ashamed to call out for my help. And for those who do, there's a special place in my heart. Your name is written there. I know that some have turned their backs on me. Some have even denied me with their words and their actions. But I am a patient father. Even when they walk away, I am here, waiting with open arms, just like the father who waited for his prodigal son. I will never stop waiting for you. If there's ever been a moment where you felt like you drifted away from me, it's okay. I'm not here to judge you. I'm not pointing out your mistakes or failures. No, I'm here to lift you up, to encourage you, and to offer you my forgiveness. My mercies are new every single morning, and today I'm offering you a fresh start. Whatever mistakes you've made, whether in your thoughts, your words, or your actions, I forgive you. It's wiped clean. If there's someone you need to ask for forgiveness from, go ahead and do it. Make it right. And after you do, don't go back to those old ways. You're free now. Right now, you're going through a trial, and I see how hard it is for you. The winds of uncertainty are hitting your life like a storm, and it feels like your boat might sink. But here's what I want you to do. Stay calm. Don't let fear take over. I haven't placed any trial in your life that you can't handle. Everything you're going through right now is under my control. It might not seem like it, but I have a plan. This moment, this season, it's not here to break you. It's here to make you stronger. You are stronger than this moment, even if you don't feel like it right now. I know there are times when you feel overwhelmed by the pain and uncertainty of it all. When that happens, I want you to remember to breathe. Close your eyes and call on my name. My grace will rush in like a flood, filling you with strength and clarity. I will give you the wisdom to make the right decisions, and soon you will find yourself on the other side of this storm, stronger and more confident than ever. You are protected. No matter how fierce the storm is, no harm will come near you. I want you to speak this over your life. Declare it out loud. God is my Father, and nothing and no one can stand against me because He is with me. Lift your eyes up to the heavens. I am right here, preparing a place for you, a home where we will reign together for eternity. Not everyone will understand or accept these words. Some will ignore them, but I know you won't. 
I see your heart. I see the purity in it. You are not like the others. In you I find no fault. Rejoice in my presence, my beloved child. I am covering your life and your family's lives with my love. Every request you've made, I've heard it. Every cry for help, every silent prayer, I've listened to it all. Don't cry anymore. I am here to comfort you and to bless you. Your future is filled with blessings. You're on a path of prosperity and joy, even if you can't see it clearly right now. I've removed the sorrow from your soul, and I am pouring healing into your body, into your mind. I'm filling your thoughts with goodness, with a spirit that cannot be shaken. My Holy Spirit is resting upon you, and right now, I'm pulling up by the root anything that has been weighing you down. But for me to complete this work, I need you to open your heart to me. Let me come in and do what I need to do. I am clothing you in new, clean garments. I am renewing your spirit, strengthening your heart. Take my promises into your heart. You have been washed by my blood, and with that comes power. Every chain that has held you back, every burden that has weighed you down, it's broken. You are free. But I need you to declare it. Say it out loud. When you pray, you will feel a joy that is supernatural. Your soul will be filled with peace, not the kind of peace the world offers, but the peace that only I can give. Take a deep breath. The race of faith is not over yet. You've been doing well, trusting in me. Don't give up now. Don't abandon the dreams I've planted in your heart. Don't let the fire of your faith die out. Dive into my word, not out of obligation, but because you long to hear from me. From this day forward, you will begin to see my blessings in every trial you face. Behind every challenge, there is a blessing waiting for you. The trials you're going through, they aren't here to make your life harder. They are here to make you stronger. Believe that. Declare it. I command you to be strong and courageous. Don't be afraid. Don't be discouraged. I am the Lord your God, and I am with you. Just as I was with Moses in the wilderness, just as I was with Job in his suffering, just as I was with Joseph in prison, I am with you now. I will do more than what you've asked for. What I am about to do in your life will exceed all your expectations. You won't even have words to describe the wonder of it, because my plans for you are greater than anything you've dreamed of. Those who doubted you, those who thought you wouldn't make it, will see my glory in your life. I will use you to be a blessing to others. Let me mold you. I am shaping your character. You are like clay in my hands, and I am the potter. Right now, I am putting an end to that problem that has been causing you so much pain. I am turning the tide. Open your heart to my presence, to my love. I want you to understand something deeply. No one will ever love you as much as I do. I know the pain you feel sometimes. I know how deep it runs. I know the tears you cry when you think no one is watching. But I see them all. I understand them and I'm here to wipe away every tear. I've come to renew your strength. Don't give up. Don't quit. You are my beloved child, and I am here to encourage you. Rejoice in my presence. Delight yourself in me. I will pull you out of this pit, no matter how deep it feels right now. Your suffering ends today. Believe that. Declare that. You are surrounded by my love, my mercy, and my peace. You are stronger than you know. Trust in me, and I will do more in your life than you ever imagined possible. I am your Father and I am with you, now and forever. The challenges you face today will soon be behind you. This storm will pass, and you will come out stronger on the other side. Trust in that, and trust in me. You are never alone. This is not the end of your story. This is only the beginning of something far greater than you could ever imagine. You are my beloved, and I have plans for you that will exceed anything you've ever dreamed of. 
Stay with me, and I will carry you through. Trust that I am always working, even when you can't see it. I am your father, and I love you more than you can comprehend. 